Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how I put together this Girl Scout Daisy Cookie. Alright guys, let's get started. Here are the things that you will need. A 3 inch 10 petal flour cookie cutter. I found this on eBay. A very small round cookie cutter. It's optional. Here are all the colors that I used. These are from Wilton. Leaf green, red, orange, this is blue, rose, I used a tiny drop for the baby pink, the sky blue, this is a purple and yellow, and these are by Americolor, this is avocado, and this is fuchsia that I used for uh, the magenta one. I also used a ton of piping bags, and you will need a lot of number one piping tips and number three piping tip for the white uh, base and a lot of rule icing. See here I went ahead and filled out my cookie. I used the white roll icing. I think I used like a tip three to help me fill it out a lot quicker. And what I did here is I made just some little lines here instead of making that whole circle there because I'm going to fill that um, with uh, icing so you don't have to be perfect or you don't have to make the complete circle. I just went inside and did some lines there just so I can see where that circle is going to be. Also as you see there, there's a lot of little kind of oval shaped uh, lines there that I made. I did this with my thinner uh, uh, edible marker. I did the ones inside with the Maricolor thicker marker. And this is all going to be underneath the icing. This is just to give me some guidelines and to uh, uh, give me an idea of where my uh, petals are going to be at and how about how much I need to fill in. So what I'm going to show you really quick is just how I got those little lines. This is about two centimeters, maybe a little bit over half an inch. So I just put it in the center roughly and then just give it some marks there. And then I, once I pipe it, I'm just going to pretty much just make a, a try to make the uh, circle there as best as I can. And so then with my other uh, marker, this one has that fine point. I just made some little oval shapes all around. And yes, I have to do it to every single one of these cookies. So this um, just serves as a guideline. Alrighty, so here I have... Uh, with a number two tip, the blue, as you see there, I, I did all the insides. Very, very easy. Just go ahead and I just kind of swirl it around like this, trying to keep that round shape in mind there, even though I didn't do the circle. I just did the marks, but I can just kind of eyeball it and make that nice little round circle. And that is it. Now I'm going to go on, on with the petals. Alright guys, as you see here, I kind of moved along uh, because it's repetitive. You're going to just fill each petal up with, um, with each color. So that's what I'm just going to show you right now what I did. And right here, for example, after the magenta comes the darker purple. So I have all the colors that I used. I used the number one tip. So what I like to do is I put a little drop there and then move back and forth and then kind of taper down towards the end, kind of give it a little bit of a petal look to it. Now all of them are going to be perfectly the same. It's almost impossible unless you take uh, your time to do every single one of them. And I have too many of these and not much time to do them. So I'm gonna do the best that I can. So now my last color would be kind of like the avocado color. And again, one dot and then kind of zigzag, kind of thick, and then kind of tapered down like that. And that's it. I'm going to let these dry. So you see they're all kind of somewhat dry already, but I'm going to put them all together. All right, guys, they are done. They're nice and dry. I'm happy with them. Uh, if you're wondering what this means, it is a daisy that the Girl Scouts have. Each color represents something. You can Google to get more information. Each petal has a meaning. Uh, the, even the center has a meaning. I believe it's called the Promise Center and the Learning Petals. Uh, so you can get some information online. Just uh, Google 
my Girl Scout Daisy and you should get some information on that. So if you are a Girl Scout and you like these, give them a try. They're not hard to do, they just require a lot of icing, a lot of colors, a lot of piping bags, a lot of tips. So um, you will uh, be doing a lot of work, but uh, generally to put the cookie together is, is pretty easy. So I hope you like how they turned out, guys. Again, if you want to uh, learn a little bit more about this Daisy, you can uh, get some information from Google. Alright guys, I thank you so much for watching. I hope you like this video. And uh, don't forget to like up the video if you enjoyed it. And uh, subscribe if you haven't done so. And stay tuned for more. I have a few more videos ready to be uploaded. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. And I will talk to you soon. Have a good one guys.